Hi, my name is John, N3LUD, and today I'm going to show you how to build a holder for a painter pole antenna mast. We are going to use a 5 gallon bucket, bucket lid, concrete mix, a piece of 1.5 inch PVC cut to 24 inches in length, and a 1.5 inch PVC cap. The painter pole needs to fit the inside diameter of the PVC pipe, so adjust your PVC accordingly. The first step is cutting a hole in the bucket lid. Right, the first thing that I did with the bucket was there's a little piece of plastic at the center of it and you want to kind of cut that piece of plastic off so you can drill a hole right in the center of the bucket. I did that with just a wood chisel here. I just notched that little piece of uh, plastic off and then I used a thin uh, drill bit and I drilled a, a center hole in the center of the bucket that I'm going to use as a pilot hole for my saw here. I actually have a two inch saw the hole needs to be big enough so that the outside diameter of the pipe fits through the bucket lid. Okay, you have a hole. Alright, the next thing you want to do is pour about six or seven inches of the, the concrete mix. I used quick read concrete mix in the red bag that's the fast setting. Six or seven inches. And you want to make sure you wear gloves and put a mask on when you're doing that because it's pretty dusty. Next thing I'm going to do is uh, pour some water in here and mix up this concrete mix. Next thing you want to do is take the cap that's on the that you're going to put on the bottom of the PVC. The reason you're doing putting the cap on the PVC is so that concrete mix doesn't work its way into the pipe. You're going to put the pipe in the center of the bucket. You're going to try to work work it down into the bottom as much as you can. What you could also do as an alternative, if this is, seems a little more difficult, is you could put the pipe in the bucket and then pour the mix around it as well. Okay, you're going to take the lid and you're going to put the lid over top of the PVC on the bucket. I'm going to try to keep this PVC pipe as straight as you can. I apologize for the background noise there with the airplanes. So I have a second bucket here that was already completed. I have the full length of the PVC um, in the bucket. You can actually cut the PVC just under the handle. That would give you the ability to carry the bucket via the handle. I like keeping it a little bit longer. You can still carry the bucket once the concrete dries uh, with using the PVC and it gives you a little extra added support for the painter pole. This is what the bucket looks like once the concrete has cured. You can see the additional empty space in the bucket that could be used for storage, such as coax cable, connectors, and so on. Here it is with the painter pole inside the PVC. We have a dual band antenna fastened to the pole with the zip ties ready for use. I don't have the coax cable connected in these photos. Here is the center T adapter for the buddy pole antenna. The bottom threads attached to the painter's pole and the top threads in this picture attached to the buddy pole antenna. Here is the buddy pole antenna attached to the top of the painter pole antenna mast with the center T adapter. I use this configuration over 4th of July weekend to work some special event stations for my backyard. Just to review the materials needed, a 5 gallon bucket with bucket lid inch and a half PVC to 24 inches in length, plus the PVC cap, concrete mix, and some water. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. 73 from N3LUD.